Clip 3, the octagonal cup. More than 30 gold and silver objects were found in the wreck. These objects are amongst the most important Tang Dynasty gold and silver objects ever found. From this group of beautifully ornamental boxes, dishes, bottles and bowls, an octagonal gold cup stands out. In its own glass case, it is located in a small room to your left when you enter the Tang Shipwreck Gallery from the entrance corridor of the main lobby. The eight sides of the cup are decorated with eight figures, seven musicians and one dancer. Each figure was cast separately, then attached to the sides of the cup. Skillfully made in China around the 830s, the rim features a repeating X-shaped design, which might represent flowers. The cup tapers gently from the rim and sits atop a circular foot carved with lotus petal designs. The outer edge of the foot is decorated with a border of small carved circles. As mentioned earlier, the octagonal cup consists of eight gold panels. Decorated with the figures of seven musicians and one dancer, lines of small carved circles form borders around each of the eight sides of the cup, framing the figures. Each of the three-dimensional figures on the sides of the cup has long curly hair and is dressed in loosely draped clothing with billowing sleeves. When this cup was made, this clothing style, along with long curly hair, was associated with people from Central Asia. The musicians hold Central Asian musical instruments, such as the three-stringed lute, with a long neck and oblong body. A cousin of the guitar and the pipa, the flute and percussion instruments, such as the frame drum and tambourine. One musician also appears to be playing a castanet-like percussion piece. Moving along to the music, the dancer claps her hands together above her head with an expression of ecstasy on her face. The cup, largest of its type known, is 9.2 centimeters tall and 13 centimeters wide at the top, including the handle. That's about the size of a large coffee mug these days. The handle is a circle of gold, like slipping your finger into a ring. The top of the handle, where you would place your thumb, is carved with the heads of two bearded men back to back. This exceptional gold cup, weighing at 619.1 grams, roughly the weight of six apples back together, would be perfect for an entertaining evening of wine drinking with music and dance as the theme of this decoration is clearly revelry. It's unclear why this cup and the few other gold and silver objects were on board a ship mostly filled with ceramics for everyday use. Perhaps they were gifts of tribute for foreign rulers or specially ordered objects for rich foreign buyers.